Welcome, in front of me is Realme P3 Lite and in this video I will show you what to do if your fingerprint sensor doesn't recognize your fingerprints correctly. In such case, let's set up a new fingerprint on this smartphone. Uh, to do this, open settings, then scroll down to security and privacy, then find device unlock section and open it. Uh, before you set up a fingerprint and face unlock, of course, you have to set up a screen lock. So let's set up a pattern, for example. Tap next and then confirm once again by entering a new pattern. Click done. And now let's set up a fingerprint scanner. A uh, fingerprint uh, screen lock. like fingerprints and if you have any previously set up fingerprints on this device uh, if they don't work correctly of course remove them then to add a new one select I agree and before you add a new fingerprint remove the protective case from your smartphone and use a dry towel to wipe the surface of your scanner so that it becomes more smooth and reads your fingerprint better. Make sure that there is no debris or anything, no dust left, no, no dirt. So just make sure that it's clean and smooth. And then proceed by adding a new fingerprint to your device. To do that, just press the scanner with different parts of your fingerprint. Try to use your whole fingerprint to ensure the best experience. And when you're done, tap done. Okay, so now the fingerprint is added and before we continue, let's go back to settings and make sure that our that the smartphone is up to date. To do that, scroll down to system and updates, software update. Um, make sure that you have an internet connection, unlike me. So to do that, swipe down the control center and tap uh, the arrow icon next to Wi-Fi and uh, select the Wi-Fi you want to connect to then enter the password now once you enter the password tap save and wait until you are connected now let's go back to software update and just make sure that your device is up to date if there are any updates uh, of course take your time to download and install them this way you will make sure that your hardware is in touch with your software and therefore all of your of your device's features work correctly now let's restart the phone. To do that, press the side button and the volume up button. And once you see this screen, uh, swipe to restart. And this way, we'll make sure that the changes applied. Now let's wait until the phone is restarted. Okay, once the smartphone is restarted, Let's try to use our fingerprint to unlock it. So, lock your smartphone. Okay, it worked well for the first time. Let's try it the second time. Okay. And as you can see, everything works almost perfectly uh, and smoothly. And I hope that it does for you too now. And if it does and if this video helped you please consider subscribing to our channel leave us a like in the comment below and i'll see you in the next one